hello everyone and welcome back to my channel so first of all I want to apologize uh, because it's been over a week since I've posted a video and this video was going to come out sooner than it is right now um, however so I was trying to transfer the finished video onto my hard drive and from my laptop to my hard drive which is what I always do and it glitched and it deleted my video and so I had to like re-edit the entire video and re-record it of course because like this video was longer than I mean shorter than my last one and so the recording just wouldn't have made sense and I also wanted to talk to you guys um, I wanted to apologize and I wanted to to thank you for being patient um it's i know it's been a while and i haven't been posting on instagram or on youtube and i'm very sorry uh i've been trying to find a balance between my new single self and <laughs> my old self and so yeah it's been kind of hard to balance like work and like me and youtube at the same time um, YouTube is not very easy, uh, building is not very easy, it takes a lot of time to edit and it takes a lot of time to build and and yeah it just it just takes a lot of time and I just want to apologize in advance uh, I'm not saying that it's a burden or that I'm gonna stop I'm just saying I'm sorry for this one I, I honestly feel like this build was cursed because <laughs> because of the whole glitch thing um, but yeah I'm so glad that it's finally out and I'm Again, I'm so sorry for taking so long. Um, but yeah, anyways, let's get back to the build. So this is a five bedroom, three bed, five bed, ugh, five bedroom, three bathroom house. And it's considered a farmhouse, but on the inside it's actually modern. So it's a modernized uh, farmhouse. And um, what I was actually thinking about doing with this build is I was actually thinking of making a Kaz video uh, right after I upload this one pretty much um, for this family. Um, but I know I haven't been building in a while and I actually don't know how to record a Kaz video, if that makes sense. I've never done one before. so. Um, but I want to do it for this one. Uh, I know it's a lot of people. It's like... Um, two teens and uh, two parents, two twins, and a grandma. So it's definitely a lot of people and um, I do have a storyline of course with this one. Um, so uh, you know the parents are like in their mid, uh, like mid 40s and you know they were pretty much done raising their children. Um, their twin, I mean not their twins, their, their, their teenage children and um, all of a sudden, surprise, surprise, they got pregnant with twins and their twin children. So, and then, you know, they're modern parents, they're working modern parents. So, you know, they, they have work and they have their own business and they have, well, I don't know about their own business, but I feel like they would have their own business, but you know, they work a lot and so the dad um, decided to call his mom up and move her into the, uh, I guess like the spare bedroom um, by the laundry room. Um, and yeah, so they got a surprise by the twins and their twins bedroom is actually downstairs, like uh, kind of across the way from their bedroom. Um, so yeah, they, they called in the grandma for the for help and um, there is a clash of styles in terms of um, some decorative items and because the mom's like super modern and the grandma's like very homey and very, you know, she's, it's just very loving and homey and stuff. Oh, um, P.S. I also want to apologize. Uh, sometimes like right there, <laughs> my mouse kind of does this weird weird scroll thing. I think it's because I have the scroll set up high on my Mac and um, I always like set it up high. Um, just, just that's how I like it. Um, 
and also I think this mouse kind of sucks so I do have to get a new one um, but I can't afford it right now <laughs> but again I just want to apologize sometimes it just looks like I'm editing all funny but it's actually my mouse <laughs> uh, so sorry about that guys um, so yeah um, there is a clash of styles in this house uh, because of the grandma and um, yeah I just wanted to make like a different dynamic for this family uh, in terms of like you know surprise twins and teens dealing with that and you know like not getting enough attention and acting out and I honestly wish we had a university because I would love to see a transition between teens and like young adults you know like if they will go to the, through the same struggles as young adults do in real life <laughs> so I don't know um but yeah um so i was thinking of doing a cast uh, for this family i don't have a family name for it uh i think i i had one and i think it was nicholas or something um <laughs> i might just name the team that or something but yeah i, I don't have the details yet but i do want to go into cast mode and build or not build <laughs> um create a family for this build particularly um so if you guys uh would like that for this build or if you want to wait for the next one that is fine as well i still have to figure out how i'm gonna uh, record and edit and stuff like that so um i might do it the same way where like i do voiceover afterwards and then make commentary basically to myself so anyway Let's get back to the build. So this is the mud room. Um, quotation, quotation. I mean, wait, no. Yeah, we have rain now, so this can be technically the mud room. I, I mean, I know the Sims won't use it as a mud room, but yeah, I, I've always wanted. To, I like mud rooms. We don't, we don't have those in California because it doesn't rain, but they look so nice in houses. When I watch like House Hunters or not House, well, yeah, House Hunters too, but like uh, property brothers and they always talk about like the mudroom stuff so so jealous <laughs> so yeah so that's the granny's room and it's right off the laundry because it's actually converted so it was a garage again it's converted uh technically like a lot of the houses that i uh reference they all have garages so when i try to build it and there's like this awkward like empty space when it like comes to roofing um i just like Put a room there <laughs> so there's always gonna be like spare room or you know like something spare but that's like supposed to be a garage and we don't have garages in the sims 4 so hopefully that's a thing not even like for function but i would love to just like build a garage garage and like have garagey things like tools and like a car I mean I know you can like size up a car but it'd be nice to have like a car that your sim would get into you know they don't have to drive it but they can just get into it that way I can have like my garages and all my my all like my houses will feel complete or whatever I just always feel like they don't feel complete um, because like there's no garage but so I'm just working on the twins' bathroom and they do have the hair and the twins are actually going to be fraternal twins. It's going to be one boy and one girl and uh, I know for like it's like awkward stages but let's just pretend like they don't have awkward stages in the Sims 4 because I mean they move from like preteen to teens like pretty quick so. <laughs> Uh, and yeah, and this is the master bathroom and all the bathrooms in this house have wood flooring because that's what the floor plan uh, showed in the floor plan that I followed. And yeah, I'm thinking of building, um, listen, I know you guys love base game builds, but I honestly cannot do base game builds. I always feel really stressed out because I don't use base game stuff I never like even before I started building I never used I mean building for YouTube I never used base game builds it's hard guys like it's really hard for me like to, to not use every item 
that I have or that piques my interest because I just scroll down. I'm like, oh, this will look good here. Oh, this will look good here. Oh, this window looks nice here. And then, yeah, sorry. Um, I'll try every once in a while to do a base game. Um, I'll try to see if I can do challenges. Um, I'm going to take it really slow uh, for YouTube. I'm going to try to do, I'm going to try to do two videos a week. Um, that's what I was trying to or, um, it's just it's very overwhelming with the editing I think this video was like 17 hours worth of footage and which is why I was so upset when it was gone I was like really mad I almost cried I, I even posted it on my Instagram story like I was so upset that I almost cried I always cry when I like get angry but yeah that that was that was bad that was a bad moment <laughs> I'm like, I cannot believe it. It's like this video is cursed for some odd reason. It's just the cursed, cursed build, cursed video. <laughs> um, so yeah, uh, and then I have the family room here. So this is gonna be like the game room area pretty much. Um, there's a TV downstairs. Uh, I don't know how functional it is because I put it on the fireplace. And I saw somebody else do that on Instagram. I was like, oh, I'm gonna take that idea. I'm sorry, I don't know who it was from. Um, otherwise, I would credit it. But I just saw it like randomly on like show us your build thing. And yeah, this is the kids' bed bathroom upstairs. And you can expand this a little bit. Um, I did that like that little. I don't know. Why I didn't think about it, but I did do like that little den thingy. So I should, I should have expanded it. I'm sorry, guys. Um, but yeah, I. Um, this is gonna be like the teens' bedrooms upstairs. Um, and I know you guys liked the the full like detail and clutter on the last one, but this build took so long. Like mentally, I was so done with this build by the end of it. So there is some like um, decorative items and stuff like that and some clutter items it's just not like as personal as the last one and I really want to apologize about that because I really want to make my builds as detailed as possible um, but yeah I'm sorry guys like I don't know and like Halloween is coming up and I really want to do spooky builds and I should have like started on a mansion already because I feel like it's gonna take forever to do. Um, everybody, you guys are always asking like on Instagram, like what computer I have. I have a really old Mac. It's like a 2010 Mac and it's like not even the best. So like every time I build like a lot or add a lot of clutter or stuff like that, or roofing tends to like slow my computer down crazy um but yeah everything just starts to slow down and it, that's why it like takes me a while because i will like stop because it's going just way too slow and it's just too stressful <laughs> so i would stop and like not you know not build for a while because of the computer or just build like the next day um, i'm sure if i upgrade though like to a newer mac it would be fine it's just this one's really old that's all and it's like a three gigahertz or something i don't know i don't know how to read those things but it's really old and has low like low slow thingy i'm not a computer person i don't know <laughs> um i was thinking of getting a pc but i don't really like the interface of pc i'm not a i'm not a we started off as pc like with the pc me and my brother i'm just not a pc user um, once we got this Mac, it was like game over for PC pretty much because I pretty much fell in love with Macs because they're awesome. <laughs> I my like my laptop's a Mac. Um, so yeah, uh, my point was that I am going to try to build a uh, spooky builds for. Um, the month of October if I end up doing like one build a week then I'm just going to um, do spooky builds all next month um, but I, I really don't want to do just one a week I really want to do at least two um, but if I do like 
scary houses. Like, I really want to do at least one mansion. So maybe that'll be like, like the finale, <laughs> like Halloween build. And then the rest of them are going to be kind of eerie ones, um, but not as big as like the mansion one. Um, so yeah, maybe I'll do something like that. That way at least you guys get some spooky builds, um, a semi-normal-ish kind of. <laughs> I'll see. I'll see what I do, guys. I swear I won't take like almost two weeks to come out with another build. And I want to thank you guys for being patient. And yeah. <laughs> so I'm just adding uh, kind of finishing touches to the downstairs. Um, I know I add like finishing touches to the twins' bedrooms in a bit. And um, the master. Oh, and for sure the granny's bedroom. Her bedroom's super cute. And you'll see right now like what I mean by like styles clashing. Um, like that thing that I put down. That's something that she brought over. <laughs> Um, and like, yeah, so like the living room has like a bit of a style clash and there is like family drama because of it. Cause the mom is like very type A, like she's not controlling, but she's very type A. Like she wants things done her way and like her time. Yeah, she's just very controlling. Not controlling, she's very type A, sorry. I don't want to say controlling, just type A. <laughs> she wants everything just so and perfect and it's modern and yeah. But of course, Granny, she doesn't care. She just wants her style to be heard as well. And yeah, you can definitely see the style clash in her room. So once you build her, I mean, you'll see her room in a bit. Um, yeah and I really wanted to add I forgot to add a booth box to the upstairs teens so he's gonna be like, kind of like a DJ inspiring and then um, the girl I think she's gonna be like artistic or, yeah, I'm not sure I want to say artic artistic she seems like an artistic vibe so I should have put an easel but uh, if you all want to customize this build, it will be up on the gallery under Bubby Simi. There's two eyes, oh, four eyes in total in Simi. Um, so if you want to like add details and you guys want to show me, I would love to see like all the details that you add to my builds. Um, because I know sometimes mine are lacking in details and clutter and stuff like that. Um. I feel like almost I built show homes where it's like simple and just, you know, um, there's a word for it. They have a word for this. Um, stage. Like, hey, it's just stage it. And I, sometimes I feel like I build a stage home. <laughs> I try not to, like, but like I said, it's it's just pretty tiring. <laughs> after, after like 17 hours worth, it's pretty tiring. Um, and, I'm, and my computer is pretty slow. I want to add more details, definitely, but yeah, this computer man. Oh yeah, so you can see the contrast between, this is the master bedroom, so you can definitely see the contrast between the granny's room and this one. Um, it's very like put together, kind of modern, um, minimal decorated. <laughs> like minimal clutter and that again will have to do with her type A personality and since I am talking about the family a lot I think I will build a Kaz video so the next one will probably be a Kaz guys um, and also ignore my intro because it still says bubbly to me and um, I was gonna change it on Filmora but I, I need to buy the program it's like $44 um, I have to wait a little um, but yeah once I get that program I'll definitely change my intro um, for now I'm gonna keep the intro just because I don't want it to be like I just don't want it to be no intro um, and Filmora was like very easy to use um, like very friendly interface user user interface so I'm just gonna stick to Filmora because it's like the only thing I know how it's very confusing out there for a new YouTuber. <laughs> Just saying. It's very confusing. Um, I'm sorry. 
with something shooting again. Sorry, sorry guys. Um, so anyway, uh, I do add a bit of details to the master bathroom. I wanted it to be like comforting and romantic um, because the parents are very, very much in love, um, of course. And yeah. Oh, here's the twins' bathroom. I just add a lot of like, I'll try to add a lot of like little details into the bathrooms and stuff. Um, I was gonna use that, but I just didn't know if I was gonna block people's ways. Um, I don't know, Sims is very, like, like, there's a word for it, I can't think of it. I'm sorry guys, I had to work this morning, and I'm not a morning person. I had to get up like at 6.30ish to get ready, and I had to go to work at 8. <laughs> I'm a very bad, like, I just cannot wake up in the morning. I like can't function. Which is why, like, honestly, I sucks that I worked mornings because I like to build at night, but then I go to the gym at night. So I'm more of a night owl and normally will go to sleep like at 4 a.m. Because <laughs> I'm either at the gym or I would come home and like work on this thing. Um, but yeah, like I said, I will find my balance, okay? And also, I'm just gonna add the final details here and there. So if you want to download this build, it will be up on the gallery under Bub Bubby Simi. Sorry, guys. And if you want to follow me on Instagram and Twitter, uh, both names are Bubby Simi. And if you like this build, go ahead and subscribe and click the like button and ring the little bell if you want to uh, get notifications of when I upload. Hopefully, it will be consistent this time. I'm so sorry, I cannot apologize enough, but yeah. So go ahead and subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. And thank you all so much for watching. And I love you all. And I will see you all next time.